yourself up to date with um, ethical policies for publishing as well as taking care of ethical issues that arise uh, during the process of publication? Yeah, so uh, there are a number of good resources for publication ethics. So one is COPE, the Committee on Publication Ethics. Uh, they have a website and it's fantastic for um, helping editors address uh, ethics issues. And it's probably a good resource also for authors to look to see how um, journals should handle uh, ethics issues. Because sometimes, you know, a problem could come up and an author may not know whether they should contact the journal or contact the editor or whether the concern that they have really is um, a valid concern or something that should be um, made known to the journal. So the COPE website is a great resource. Um, there's also a couple of blogs right now that monitor uh, retractions. So Retraction Watch is one blog that I subscribe to. It keeps me up to date on uh, famous authors <laughs> as they become infamous uh, for misconduct. I can keep an eye on whether any of these authors are active in our journals. Uh, there's also Pub Peer which is an online post-publication journal club, as they describe it. But really what it does is if a reader has questions about anything within the manuscript, they can raise the question to the author and also inform the journal through the blog. Uh, and that's one way that we get informed if there's a concern about misconduct is if we get a message from pub peer saying that someone has raised a concern. Um, and there are also uh, industry communities, um, Council for Science Editors, and also um, ISMTE uh, are organizations that raise the issues that um, other journals may be having within their um, departments. And it's a nice way to see that maybe we're having issues with, um, you know, authors failing to give us information about a certain aspect. Um, if it's happening in other journals, then we can work together to find a way to make guidelines more clear or resources more accessible for our authors.